So th this is a little bit different than uh, collecting water vapor and, and basically uh, commercializing it into water. This is a proprietary technology that uh, uh, collects sunlight and air and then uh, through heat uh, transforms it into water molecules and then we uh, basically remineralize. But you're right, the technology is quite expensive. And what we've been doing is waiting for the right technology and the right research and development to make sure that we can generate the right quantities of water to be able to uh, uh, you know, properly commercialize it into a product that can be sold and can be distributed uh, to, uh, to markets. As well as the right technology that can give us the right scale and the right amount of uh, liters of water for us to be able to go to communities and help them properly. And this is the technology that's actually the only technology in the world that was able to solve it that is completely off-grid. You have other technologies today that require a lot of power to uh, take moisture from, from the atmosphere and turn it into basically water, which is water vapor into water. But they're not off-grid and they're not sustainable in the sense that they require a lot of electricity. But this one here is completely self-sufficient and it's completely off-grid. So once we place it in our factory, we never need to power it through electricity and we never need to maintain it. So it keeps on generating water, right? It's, it's just like the gift that keeps on giving. So we're building a water farm basically from the sky and um, we are breaking ground in the next few months. So I would say the first bottle that you're seeing here will, uh, will, will hit uh, retail shops by mid next year. Yeah, because it takes some time to build the, uh, the field. And then the field is going to be a museum. You can go visit the museum. You know, you can take your kids, you can take your family for them to see what the future looks like. And then what we want them to do is, uh, is, is really think about these things once they, once they do new projects and once they do new endeavors. Uh, the, what I love about this is that it does not only still and sparkly, but it also gives us the option to do flavors, right? Yeah. Proper flavors, uh, good tasting flavors with minerals. In the next two, three months, we will start building the water farm. Uh, it's, it's a huge uh, uh, square, meter, square meter area. So we will need to build it, perfect it, link it to our factory. And then the factory will start producing the bottles that you're seeing here. And then obviously, the, what we call the pipeline filling and the fall, uh, fallout into retail will start happening.